Hi guys. So I was asked to watch this live interview. It was with Toddy Skip. They were talking about Gypsy Rose Blanchard. And then people were telling me like, oh, Sir Morbid actually says something negative about KJ. This stream is five hours long. I've had to watch it on sped up at two, two times, um, as fast as it would go. It was kind of like, like kind of how like I talk whenever I screw up my words, which is a lot. But anyways, I found the, I found the part. I haven't listened to it yet. I want to do it with you guys. So I'm going to press play and then let's we'll watch it. This is kind of like out of left field. <laughs> so this crystal ball without a crystal ball, I've been so gracious and nice to her. <laughs> And I got a lot of shit bringing her up on oh, my panel. No. And I said, hey, guys, be nice, whatever. Let's just hear her story. And we see how rude she is every time she's on this panel. But I guess she's been talking shit about me. I'm, tar I'm sorry, Toddy. I know you're... <laughs> how many times, guys? How many times did we tell Morbid to not let her up there? And then the idiot gives her a wrench. Who does that? Um, it's called research. You literally have to, nowadays, especially nowadays, with all these creators talking about Gypsy, you have to really research who you're going to have on your panel because some of these people are just whack jobs. For instance, KJ. Not into this drama stuff, and I trust me, I don't want to be in it. She's on TikTok talking shit about me, <laughs> about old troll videos, because she has low IQ and she falls for <laughs> stupid stuff. Um, so I'm going to have to school her at one point and address it, and it's not going to look good. And uh, I'm trying to evolve, Toddy. I swear to God, I'm trying to be a good person, man. Um, yeah, so, but if she's commenting, then you can comment back. You yeah, know? there's some, some stupid things she's talking about. Clap back. And, Whatever it is, maybe attention, unless you come back in here, conspiracy uh, T, and talk to me uh, directly to my face, and we could go ahead and hash out the issues that yeah, you think wait, you know. Wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. I don't believe that for a second. I think if KJ came back in his live, in the chat, he would let her on panel, and she would still be rude to everybody. And he will be talking just like, so you know... This happened, and I heard you say it. And she, no, no, I didn't. And she'll just lie, and then that'll be it. And I guarantee he will not do or say anything to her to put her in her in her spot. She just, he just won't. I just, I can't see it. I mean, the girl on the bottom right hand screen, Apple Charlotte, she's gorgeous, by the way, in a lover accent. She was asking a question to KJ, right? And that was the other night when she was on Morbid's panel. And she was so damn rude to Apple. It was, it was disgusting. And Morbid let it happen. And that's why a lot of the people that were in his chat, they left and a lot of people unsubscribed. And then I was sent a video about him, which is on my community tab. It's bad. Uh, this guy is um, ban evading on YouTube, apparently. He's been around for years. Not a good guy. I watched the video and from this other guy's channel. That's where I got it from. I was sent it. I watched the video and I was, it was it was bad. It was really bad. Um, I haven't watched any more videos on him, though. I just, I couldn't do it. Um, yeah, I couldn't do it. But I'm telling you, KJ watches my shit. Because that's where she found out about the video about Sir Morbid that this other guy did. Now she's talking about it all over TikTok. Imagine that. And same with that puppy photo. She had no idea about it until she watched my video. And how I know, you want to hear something really sick? So she's live tonight and she was on her panel and she's talking about this puppy pick, puppy pick and she's blaming Brie. She's saying Brie posted it and said that that poor dog, that poor puppy was V. And you want to know something? The girl didn't even get mad. She didn't have a fit. She didn't swear. Nothing. KJ didn't even get mad. So you know what that tells me? KJ did this so she can feign outrage, make herself look like a damn victim again, guaranteed, because she's not mad about it. She's not like she would be any other time of something. Don't talk about my son. Yeah. When she's like that, you know, okay, whatever. Something's bugging her. But when you're so normal and you're verbally, like your tone is just completely straight, you know, not up and down and you're just not having a fit like you normally would when it comes to your son, Katie, that makes me wonder if you've done this yourself. I absolutely believe that. 
That's not who you're talking about. No, no, you're talking about Katie Joy right now. Not yes, yeah. I am. Yeah. Yeah, but and conspiracy I, is not the same person as Katie. Oh no, Joy. no, no. Oh, no. did I say conspiracy? Yes. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. Without a crystal ball, not conspiracy. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, that yeah, was yeah. Red Banyan. It wasn't him. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Yeah, conspiracy is a friend of mine. Uh, no, I'm talking about Crystal Ball. Right, right, okay. And yeah, no, Katie um, Joy. I, I know who she is. I, yeah, um, so I'm getting a lot of people uh, messaging me about it. The king's been kissing my butt. Going I'm live, talking about. trash. And garbage, hot garbage. <laughs> she said um, that she said on one of our st- someone was replaying our stream. I can't remember who it was, but it's, I, I was listening to. It. I thought, oh wait, it was E. I always get this lady's name uh, wrong. Is it E C E C E C K? Oh, E K C, Erin. Um, something people. She's got. She's a creator. So I think she's from New Jersey or that area. I'm not quite sure. Erin, her name is. Yep. Oh yeah! Oh, the girl who's constantly trying to read. She just reads the um, the medical yeah. reports. No, she. she oh, okay. She she always has at the bottom um something like. Oh, I can't remember. Anyway, she was listening back to one of um Katie's live lives from TikTok, and they were talking about something, and I just heard, "Well, Sir Morbid has bit." She's on his panel, and I thought, wait, is that because I asked her that question the other night, and I didn't know that she was going to flip, you know? And then she did, and she, she you know, so because yeah. I did apologize. So, well, I just yeah, that was gross what she did to Apple. Getting that information, I'm not going to talk about it now because I'm going to take some time to think about it. And then, well, if anybody has screen recordings, and people have already sent me of tonight's live, and she's live. She was talking shit. Uh, and she's, she comes in here all the time. I mean, she comes in here, so I don't know why she would do that. She DM'd me too. She does it because she's a piece of shit. Why don't, why doesn't anybody ever listen to me? Nobody listens to us, guys. We tell them and tell them and tell them what and who she is. A damn monster. And they still don't listen. You know what? I don't feel sorry for any of them. You were done told. Oh, well. She DM'd me Star yesterday. Morbid. Uh, during my live stream, and Nicole, we she had DM'd him yesterday. What? And I told her, "You're Sir an idiot. Morbid. You're dum dum. How come oh. you don't have a high IQ?" No, I didn't say that, but I mean, basically, essentially, that's what I said. Is like, are you serious? I mean, don't you know what trolls are and how they are able to play out of context content and spin their narrative? And have you f- told you he went yell at her or be stern with her? Follow the T on those people that make these videos. Uh, well, clearly she's not well, too bright. Can you guys hear me? Yes, yes ma'am. Yeah. Am I too loud? You're perfect now, I think. Yay. Okay. Actually, hey, you're not, but we I'll deal with it. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, I came over here because um, I did tell you I was going to come off, uh, come on on my next day off. Uh, uh, Katie Joy is live on uh, TikTok talking mm-hmm. shit about you. <laughs> that's what, yeah, yeah, that's what I said. <laughs> yeah, I said that. I, I know. Funny. People messaged. Oh, you already know? Yeah, so now I'm going to... Yeah, no. I um, need to respect Tati because, you know, she the first time here... She well, probably, uh, so, uh, so I, I have my own thoughts about Katie Joy. I'm Ooh, ready do to tell. share if you want to hear. Uh-huh. You can say so, whatever you want. I mean... Yep. I am We're hanging I, out no with friends that. here. This is what we no do problem. on this what channel. Do you think, because Tati? actually, um, I thought she might be on the panel simply because I have seen her on your, um, I have seen her on your uh, channel. Uh, so anyway, I see um, her over here all the time. Yeah, she's so, over here all the time. Mm-hmm. So I, um, yeah, it's ridiculous. I, I used to follow her as just somebody that used to watch TikTok, and then I used to watch like, uh, I'm sorry, uh, YouTube, and I used to watch like a lot of the reality. Um, the sister wives and stuff, and she was a big, you know, sister wives contributor as far as content creator. So then Garrison Brown died. Yes. And I lost every ounce of anything I ever felt or thought towards this woman because she exploited the shit out of this kid's death to where it was. High five to totally skip. Sickening. It was gross. It was disgusting. You can't take you. How do you come back from that? I was just. And Garrison Brown is, for those that don't know, a son uh, of. The sister wives. Uh, one yeah, of the, he, one of the kids. He was one of the and kids. And he committed suicide, I believe, or something he like did, that. He did. He did. Okay. He, yes, right. he did. And I mean, 
like it was merciless. It was disgusting. Ruthless. It was despicable. It was I just couldn't even understand how people could follow her. Like, the, like okay, report on his death. Do a couple of videos how the family's doing. How she just went on and on and on, and I was just like, oh my, I it was, it was harassing. What is she like, doing? Was, so it looks like KJ will be going after Toddy Skip. You mean kind of how she did Dee Dee? Yeah. It was. It was. It was terrible. Ooh, that's it was, this was just. This this family didn't deserve this. This no. was, and then to say that, like, I don't care. You like Cody. You don't like Cody. Who the hell are you to say it was his fault and it was his mother's fault for not? Who the fuck are you? Yes. My language <laughs> to when these people are grieving to start pointing your. Who the hell are you to start start pointing your fingers and going on and on and I just. I really like Toddy. Um, I watch her a lot actually. Um, it's funny. She kind of reminds me of me, or I remind. I'm we're kind of identical. Like, who the fuck are you? We just don't care. <laughs> I, she's a piece of shit. Yes. I, she's a piece of shit. <laughs> you don't do that. She as, as a human she being, her. you don't do that as a human being. And then I saw the video where I, I don't know how old it was, where she was talking to fancy and it was, it was before they had a falling out. It was before she <gasps> was friendly with, um, better son. the Blanchard family. Um, Katie Joy. So it was before then that they did a video where she's explaining things. That's amazing. I know it's exactly what she's going to say. It's going to be the one where she thinks that her son <laughs> can commit murder. Now, that's awesome that she saw it too. That video has gone viral. Everybody's seeing it. Everybody, including TikTok from me. Fancy was explaining things to Katie Joy. And then I guess Katie Joy decides she wants to be in with the Blanchards and accepts all of their behavior. Until they want nothing to do with her, and now all oh, of I'm her wrong. behavior, all Whoops. of their behavior is questionable. Well, all of their behavior was questionable when you were friends with them. So <laughs> why didn't you call them out on it then? See, that's the problem that I have. I have friends, right? And if they do the wrong thing, I don't say it in front of everybody, but I might say, hey, man, you could have handled that better. Bad day, but it's a bad look on you. You know, that's what you do for your friends. You want them to show up and, and do the right thing. They all have bad days. We, we get that. But... You don't sit there and co-sign it mm -hmm. until they've said, hey, fuck you, Toddy. And then you're like, oh, let me get them back. You know what I mean? It's like, no, your behavior wasn't okay before then. Now you can say, fuck you, Toddy, because I'm calling you out. But you see what I'm saying? Oh, and yeah. that's who Katie Joy is. So she's somebody who has no soul. And she is apparently led by the dollar. Yes. So good luck with that. Absolutely. Well, I'll tell you this. I'll tell you this much. She's over on TikTok right now looking like an absolute gerbil. Um, <laughs> talking ish about Sir Morbid after oh. she has been on this panel for uh, I'll, I'll say her. like <laughs> thanks for the she's looking like an absolute gerbil <laughs> <laughs> oh that's fucking funny sub like five coming or six live times. streams trust me I'll handle that I, I just thought, need people I to send me the uh, uh, the uh, live stream if if you guys are recording it I'll handle thanks it. for the sub well, I've, I've been too nice just, to her. I really have. No, he's, stuck he's my saying neck like some that. really egregious things about you, though, over there. Oh, uh, I know. I know. That. I mean, I'm not new to this game. I mean. Okay, well, I am. So I, no I, I, I am. I just don't think that it's was terrible. Yeah, but I could handle. But it here's pretty the thing. Quick. Why don't? Here's the thing. So that's not a good look. We we could all agree on this panel. Well, right did here. something it's happen? Good. Did something happen? Why is she? Why? She, I feel like anytime she don't get her way on something, she pull out. Like she literally just start exposing people that she was cool with. I don't know. So, yes, that's, that's what I'm saying. Like. That's what I'm saying. Like, how, how, did, how did so she what is she have... talking about over there? She flips on a dime. She flips on a dime. Yes. Exactly. So how do people depend on, like... Finally, people are getting it. Now, if they would fucking stick to this and let her have it. I'm not saying that I have to have a swear show at her. Let her know. Like, look at lady. You're not coming back up here. You're not welcome up here. Why would anyone want to let that bitch back on? Why? Why would you let her in your chat? So that goes for Toddy, especially Sir Morbid, and any of these people that have channels. Don't. That's how you are rewarding her bad behavior by allowing her on panel and in your chat. So if you guys see KJ in there again on Sir Morbid's, which something tells me you're gonna, I have a huge feeling that she's gonna be back and they're gonna make up because Morbid has no fucking balls. Well, I don't know. It's important to me when I, when I follow a content creator that you know, that they're it's genuine, just, that I know what to, you know what I mean? Like I know where they're coming from because if we align, that's why I'm following them. You know what I mean? Because, but 
if, if you can't trust the per- like you can't trust her. She's a snake. Yes, she is a snake. So I, the way she's acting over there, like he's in- <laughs> like Toddy's like my my what do you call her? My, like my my like my superwoman. She speaks my language. I love it. Almost in tears. She's acting like something happened. Like he like you like you did something. Like you. Uh, she messaged me last night during my live she's stream. She's in tears. And I was having a conversation. Cause I'm nice like that. And um, see, and uh, you know, he even admits it. He she emailed me yesterday, and I'm nice like that. Exactly. You're gonna let her walk all over you again, and then your panelists will sit there and be like, "No, nah. that's what I think." I hope they speak up. I think Apple Charlotte will because she's clearly knows what's up. Start talking shit about fancy and how oh, she's being. Uh, I have it here. Oh, so I'm blocked. Um, <laughs> Is I, she on like medication or something? Like she, I've never she's seen on her all. She's on Arthur because she says she's like, I'm blocked. <laughs> Honestly, guys, I think it's funny at this point because like people don't listen and then you hear the same song and dance over and over and over. It's just laughable at this point. Because so I'm blocked. <laughs> I've known all I'ma say this, Adderall doesn't do that because Yeah, it's not given Adderall. It's I'm not given- saying that I'm not yeah. saying you know who's on Adderall? Bree. Bree is on Adderall. That's why she don't shut up for 15 consecutive hours. Uh, um, I don't think you actually watched KJ, obviously, if you were saying that. Um, hey, hey, no, this, no, this, no, this, no. no. Miss Mams is on that powder, is what she Yeah, well, yeah. Okay. But I've known her since 2018, and I saw her behavior then. Because Adderall I mean, Did you just say Miss Mams, up. Nina? That's a whole... Never mind. Yeah. No, you're right. You're probably right. I don't know. All I can say is everybody that has had any kind of entanglement with her, per se has came off, like, she, the way I see it, this is just my opinion, but it's like she uses people and when they're no longer of use to her, that's when toys are out the pram. Yep. She's well, like, three, three days ago, I saw a TikTok creator um, saying how she was on uh, watching this uh, your panel uh, ceremony over. You don't got real popular over there on um, the TikTok streets, just so you know. Oh. And and uh, as you should, as you should, because you create great content. But um, she was, uh, this other creator was saying, like, how she just didn't appreciate how Katie Joy was like overtaking your panel. And when people were speaking about like their thoughts, just their thoughts on the whole Blanchard situation, she was like intervening and interrupting. Like, well, mm-hmm. I was friends with them. I, uh, 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 uh. But yeah, but in her own video, she says, when, when she, she changes it up all the time. She says, I, I wasn't friends with Gypsy. I only talked to her on the phone twice. <laughs> but then like when to use it in her defense, she was like, yeah. I was still close to them for five years. I was close <laughs> to them for five years. You have no idea. Like, I know everything. And it's like, it, it seems like you were the only person close to them that they didn't tell shit. <laughs> they, they see she, how, she's a bold-faced liar. Ken told me business. a lot of truth about her privately, and I'm not going to share that because that's between me and Ken. And I'll, I'll probably... I need to get an interview with Ken. No, I'm just joking. Well, no, I'm not actually. Hey, Ken, email me. <laughs> the cool fair not <laughs> Get some more shit out of Ken uh, <laughs> in regards to her because now I will address her uh, appropriately at the right time. You better. Uh, and it'll be on my time. It'll be next live, most likely. It's pre- pretty quick. I could do it. Um, I allowed her. No, on no, don't listen to us. Go hear it for yourself. Don't listen to us. Yeah, I'm gonna, when I said yeah, it, I, I know. Be very Trusted people have already sent me stuff. I'm t- right now. It's like two one thirty in the morning, so I'm watching this right now. So I'll, Llama Girl will have the clips out of KJ going live and going off on Morbid. So uh, I think I'm gonna. Yeah, I'll just put this out tonight, and then well, for me it's tonight. It's like one thirty in the morning, and then tomorrow I'll make another video. <sighs> when I said about, when I I said about the, the Adderall, by the way. I'm only quoting what Katie Joy has quoted herself. She quotes yes. herself that she's taken out Ad- Adderall, and then I've heard loads of other creators saying that she snorts it. Mm-hmm. I don't know what Adderall does, so I'm not. I was just saying someone asked if she's on any medications or something, or, or whatever. And I just said, well, I know that she no, takes. No, I, I, I asked if she was on medication, but at some point we have to stop. Uh, like I'm talking about, even just the question I asked. These are these people's characters, regardless of what they're saying. Absolutely, on. I agree with you. They, right. they're, and they're, Adderall they're, doesn't do that. I'm yes, just I would you imagine it does. Believe I believe like, <laughs> it. It does if you don't need Adderall. And when you run out, which you're not supposed to run out, you're supposed to have a month's worth, right? She should not be running out of Adderall and taking her sons. That you're that That's illegal. Oh, I don't, I don't, you know, I'm just saying <laughs> that's all it does. Yeah. It does, this helps you focus. It's- I just think it's really sad that how uh, Sir Morbid like lent his platform to let her tell her story whenever she got butt hurt about the Blanchards, and now she over on a whole different platform, like literally. He's the idiot who kept letting her up and trashing her, her panelists and being rude to the audience. He let her up how many times, guys? Was it like f- four times? Y'all see it for yourselves. I, and I don't even come at content creators because, like I said, I'm not a content creator. But this bitch is sitting over there looking like a whole hamster. Well, she has nothing <laughs> better to do. 
Oh my god. Okay, you gotta do that again. You know. I know like, what content creators, because like I said, I'm not a content creator, but this bitch is sitting over there looking like a whole hamster. She has nothing <laughs> better to do. You know, I know, like, but I, I feel like it's really, it's kind of weird. Oh my god, that should be my title for tomorrow, this bitch over there looking like a whole hamster. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That you were so kind to like lend your platform to her and like several content creators that join your stream or your panel, they get interrupted, they get over talked, they get overlooked. He alone it. When they actually have like actual connections to the Blanchers. So, so which when I first uh, scrolled down and I, I was on the For You page and her life came up and her she was saying how you are wrong because of that Habitat for Humanity woman who was giving her own testimony. Let me tell you something. This drug, Katie Joy, your hamster face ass, you have never <laughs> met the Blanchers in real life. This woman was on Sir Morbid's panel speaking on how she, she, she actually visually saw Gypsy Rose at a 14, 15 year old age gap, putting her hands on people that were building a house for her. She, Katie Joy is over there saying how it's you're so wrong for um, letting this lady come and say her testimony. And it seems like every time someone actually has a testimony that has a little bit more tea than what she has, mm -hmm. that's when she flips the script. Yes. Katie mm -hmm. Joy has no tea. She doesn't even know the Blanchers. They I look know. at her as a clown show. Point. Even Bree that's is more point, um, uh, reliable as a source uh, because at least Bree, you know. She's Talks the dancing monkey that she is for the Blanchards, and that's okay. Uh, but uh, Katie Joy is a nobody. Uh, she <laughs> makes shit up on the fly. But, you know, you let her talk, and you get shit out of it. And that's why I love her. That's um, the same thing. <laughs> that's you know, if you here. keep listening to Brie no. talk for those 14 consecutive hours, she end up telling on herself and Gypsy. You know what the saddest bit is? Is that you look at, you look at her following, and she's got a platform. She's mm -hmm. got a platform that... I mean, I don't know everybody on this panel, but I, she's got a platform bigger than I think everybody on this panel. Am I wrong? No. She's got a huge platform. Yeah. Where she could be doing yeah. something that makes a difference. Mm -hmm. Something that, you know, She has almost 400,000 uh, subscribers. And she she's a destructive person. She destructs. She destroys things. Where? That, that's your Where the, legacy. 400,000 people. And what are you putting out there that is helpful? The what number she's hitting is like somebody who has maybe less than 50,000 subscribers. So uh, clearly a lot of people have lost interest in what she has yep. to say for years. And wouldn't you and, think so? Because, I mean, uh, listen, you look at people and you see nobody likes a backstabber. And you, we get, I don't know, I'm an older person. So you, you can see if somebody's talking bad about you, about bad about the person that left the room you know that ultimately you're going to leave the room. They're going to talk bad about you. So people know that it can't, it's not a good look when you, we see her. I see her. She's a snake. I'm not the only one that thinks that because you're I not because I call her a snake all the time. See the comments that people have written about her. And I don't understand. Why wouldn't you try to change? Right. And why do you think that's OK? First of all, why do you think that that behavior is OK? Because she thinks just she's like, just like just just like Gypsy has 10. A lot of people watch people to watch them fall. The now, train wreck. Right, right, I, right, I, right. I'm only 31 years old. I have never heard of a without a ball head crystal ball or a <laughs> Katie gerbil face joy until she, she fell out with the Blanchards. I've never heard of her, never seen her. Now, I, I have. I, the only reason why I heard about her is because she was circulating in that little al algorithm on TikTok. That's it. Okay. This girl's but funny. A lot of people watch these people because they just want to see their demise come to them. Mm -hmm. and, I, I, and I really do believe that's why... Uh, Gypsy Rat Face Rose has so many followers. I think people are just one. They're just tuned in. People like to see stuff like this. Yeah, no. I agree with that. Drama I agree cells. with that. And I already knew about Crystal's um, past. I'm not stupid. I mean, people send me shit all the time and um, about her. About So you did know about KJ. Then why the fuck would you let her up? Are you serious? <laughs> wow. You know, uh, people that made videos on her and I, I just, whatever, I don't care. Just come up here and say what you want and I'm okay but with that's you. the thing, though, Sir Morbid. It's it's awesome that you you have that like pattern of apathy. But there are some people who actually do yep. begin to care about these people. I and know that. Yeah. I'm happy that you're not affected by this. I but, used to be a lot, so I can't say I wasn't. I was so never. You just grew like thick skin behind it. But for her, I I think she was on your panel last night, and I've I've seen clips on on TikTok of her being on your panel for the past like two three weeks. Yep. So for her, the allegation she's making upon you right now, and um. Like on, and not to even say it's here. Like this, got to be. I don't think this is like medication induced. I think this is like this. I think she has like a demonic 
entity dwelling <laughs> up. <laughs> 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 That's where my head went to the band. Guys, KG, you heard it here first. KG needs a fucking exorcism. <laughs> Star. She flipped the script in 36 hours. She flipped the script in 36 hours. Yeah. And she is on. She is. On, she has like a total of like five. When I saw it, it was like 400, 500 people watching, and she is on there trying to dem- demonize you like she knows you personally. <laughs> That's the same thing she did to Christian. I don't know Gipsy. her. I don't want to know She's her. She's done it to And thousands. I think Christian and Gypsy saying the same thing. Like, listen, I'm, I, I can't stand the Blanchers, but I'm gonna tell the truth. This. This weirdo is literally going around pretending to be super tight, super close to everybody that she meets just because she has some type of contact with them. I know. She uh, has zero you know tea. Her tea sucks. I would return it. This girl uh, knows KJ. Katie Joy, too. do you know Sir Morbid's middle name? Do you know his favorite color? Do you know Chrissy's middle? Like, do you know? I, like, y'all don't, you don't know these people. Like, we were, I had a friendship with them. We were good. Uh, 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 yeah, uh, uh, friends? Listen. <laughs> Just... A, bitch got, a bitch got three times to cry on the internet in front of me before I start to understand that this is all a gimmick. Yep. She is crying about people that she don't even know like that. Are you talking about somebody's screen name and making allegations about them? Like, you are a certified... Is her name even really Katie Joy? Like, I don't know. I just feel like that's really I weird. don't know, but last know. night she sent me multiple messages and I'm like, mm-hmm. okay, whatever, calm down, blah, blah, blah. You're, but you know, what, was she, what was she saying? Uh, it wasn't. I, I don't know. I deleted like, it, but it was. It was just like I could probably get it back. But um, and she was, and then at the end, like she was like, "Is this that? true about you?" What Natasha Cooper says. I said, "Natasha oh, Cooper God. is your new is your CNN and Fox News." Right. And that's who you're following as right. a news guy. That's you idiot. And I, I didn't say idiot. I said, "No, you're, you're, you're you know you don't know what you're talking about. You don't know uh, what you're saying right now." And she's like, "I just want to protect my son." Like, what the fuck does your son have true. to do with Morbid? Are you kidding me? Yeah. Her Morbid? She brought her son up. And then she says, by the up. way, look out for Fancy because Fancy's going to screw you. And I said, wow. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Here we go. <laughs> don't believe Fancy. Was, uh, Here we like, go. I don't get into drama shit, but now you have my ear. Hold on, Trying wait. not I, to I be a question, guys. You said she said to protect her son? Mm-hmm. Yeah, against some alien attack. I don't even know what attack she's <laughs> under. I, I just, what you know, an alien attack? attack. But guys, on, on that note, I got to get the hell up off of this internet. Um, thank you for letting me up. I, this, these are the type of people that I'm I'm actually, I would I would actually shoot in a kneecap if they came <laughs> in, my, in my direction. Um, I got to go. Love y'all. Thank you. Right, thank you. Oh, Champagne, please back. come on my platform. You're a funny as hell. Yeah, I don't know how to reply to it. I just said, I'm sorry this is happening to you and your son. I don't it's know not your problem, though. She should stop doing that. I mean, no, I feel bad because I think it was oh, the deep, first... uh Wait a minute, a Bree Doxter son? Well, that's I three. Don't, I don't, I no, don't she know. Didn't. She names other people involved. And I'm, I don't, I'm like, I don't even know these people. I don't I care. Mean. After I hit end live stream, I don't think about these people. Can I, I don't just even know I, who these people are. I know that we promote other creators on this channel, and I accidentally, like, miss, miss, um, I didn't give out the, the creator's proper information. Um, someone in the chat said, it's actually the channel that covers Katie Joy and sort of breaks down all, all our lives and stuff. It's EKC people suck and her name's Erin Costello and what she does is she goes through and sort of like you know and I don't even care enough to <laughs> watch any bad videos about her that's no, how no, much, I'm just how because that's how insignificant uh, this individual is to me I know it's just because we promote people and it would have been wrong of me to not correct that channel owner because she's a nice woman but I know I'm not stupid. I knew that um, she's sure? a, a whack job, mm-hmm. a weirdo. Because she wouldn't. Yeah, yeah. I don't even get a word in edgewise with this lady. Oh, yeah. Oh, and she talked about you, Apple. She said, "How could you have people on your panel oh, last night?" Uh, message oh. me on TikTok. How could you have people what? on your panel like this Apple lady uh, questioning me about something? And uh, she asked and the she's fucking like, I know question. You've been nice to me, but why would you have oh, these people God. on panel? Meanwhile, said, she was rude. To Apple. I don't control you. these people. Their dad or your fucking parents. They're individuals. They say wow. whatever they want. I'm oh, so pissed now that I know she came after Apple. I'm sorry. Yeah, Apple. that's <laughs> awful. That is awful. Especially no, no, no. since she was so rude. No, it's okay. All the I, nicest person on here is Apple. All I said was, all I was doing was reading the chat because the chat were getting a bit angsty. They were, you know, they were getting like... Oh, She's definitely cool. the nicest one. Sorry? <laughs> she blamed me and then she blamed She's me for definitely the, the, the nicest one. Oh, yeah. Apple, like, though, Toddy, how do you control like uh, random people on the internet? Nina, I mean, you guys have a power over the people... Individuals no. that have their own Boot them off. Well, Block them. All I did was ask her a question from the chat. Someone, there was quite a few people actually, were asking, didn't KJ Dox Dan? Dan, yeah. And that's how we found out about the old Dan. And I asked her, and I said, and I didn't know because I didn't know this. So I asked her, and she didn't like the question. And then she proceeded to talk over me. And because she proceeded to talk over me, I just said, 
sorry, Katie, but you were like you cut, you you spoke over me and told me to stop talking when, you know. So and then she didn't. She basically didn't like what I was asking, so she nope. jumped off the panel. I apologised. I am sincerely. I am sorry. Oh, I didn't want really to upset her. But then I went on to find out that actually upset her. If you breathe wrong, you'll upset her. She <laughs> yeah, over kind of that way. She but rage she quits. Just I mean, like a little weirdo. And I felt terrible about that, but like. Apparently, she did have Dan's social security number up on a yes. on a live stream yep. for over an hour before she realised it was there. And this is from watching copious others, copious of other creators' videos. It's not just hearsay. So it actually happened. I've seen it, and it actually mm-hmm. happened. So she did technically. If you, I don't know if that constitutes stocks. And all the shit it. she says about all the tea. You have no tea. Uh, the Blanchers don't even care about you. That's how insignificant you are. <laughs> uh, Rod doesn't even know your first name, last name. Um, <laughs> You're just a loser they found on the internet. Yep. You I'm were says Brie before says Brie was says Brie. That's who you are. On the internet, really like sad. Yeah. I just genuinely. Sorry. Sorry, guys. I just genuinely. Oh, no, you're yeah, That's all. I, just, I, I was. That was not what I was trying to do. Because I knew. Oh, we know that. Yeah. Yeah. There were other people on the panel that I know their stance. I knew their opinions of her as well. So, like, but I was being neutral and non-biased because that's it's professional and that's how you should behave. I'm a guest on Sir Morbid's panel. Right. So, yeah. yeah. The thing with me, though, and I try not to, like, judge people by, by any, like, appearance, but her voice really annoys me because <laughs> she always sounds so condescending. Yeah. She has that cadence. But, Do you guys think they get it? I think they get it. <laughs> yeah, yeah she it's has like you that. gotta kiss her ass. I mean, I'm sure everybody in her box has to kiss her ass. They do. Um, or they get blocked. You know. You can't even ask questions. A, I don't know. What do you call it? Uh, the Entitled? only word, term I could think of is dumbass. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm I'm not dumb, an intellect dumb. here. I don't like know how else to describe narcissism. Yeah, she's like that condescending popular girl in high school. That <laughs> popular? Oh Are you God, kidding me? I'm gonna, I'm gonna <laughs> don't even get me started. About Have you looked at her hamster face there, Coco? She, rege- she was the kid that was in a locker room or a locker stuck mm-hmm. in there overnight. Probably. <laughs> That's why she peanut butter and now. jelly sandwich between those holes. Um, they, have, they probably had to mash it up in a blender just as uh, Toddy One Skip did to the one, that one inmate. That's right. That's right. That's Don't right. cross me. That's right. Don't get me started, KJ. KJ. And Stick to your sister wife. Stick to your sister wife. It's one thing to, like, you know, it's one thing to maybe, like, maybe stretch the truth a little bit, like, although it's still not good in general, but. She likes to take events, mm-hmm. like even if they are true. And I don't think that most of the most, if all the things she says are true, because she just spouts random BS. But she really likes to take things she hears and exaggerate yes. them to ridiculous proportions. Oh, and gosh. I just can't subscribe to that. Ninety nine percent of the shit that she said is untrue and mm-hmm. stupid. And I don't even like yes. it, you know. See, this is what I like. Creators and even subscribers and members like calling her out and speaking the truth. What I don't like is when she comes in the chat, they all start kissing her ass and then let her up on panel to spew more bullshit. I really, 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 really hope that doesn't happen again on any of these people's platforms. I really hope so. I don't know. I have a feeling though Morbid's going to let her back in. Something tells me. Yeah. So So, that's bullshit. Um, Everything she said. I just think they're... I just think her condescending tone makes it all worse. Mm-hmm. I can't stand the way she talks. I'm sorry. <laughs> but my thing is, how does she, how does she, like, how does she rectify that she co-signed these people's behaviors before their friendship ended, but when their friendship ended, these are now bad people. Right? That's what I've been asking. That's what I don't get. You know I don't know, I mean? but I've never been a friend to her. I mean, I just was friendly. No, I'm talking yeah. about, no, no, I'm just talking Gypsy about, and Crispy. Like, just in general. she Crispy. knows all of this, well, she knows all of this bad stuff about Gypsy and Christy and all of their deep, dark secrets that she was willing to hold and they were sacred to her when they got along. But now that behavior from the Blanchards is despicable and how dare they. Right. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like why that it's the same behavior. The yep. only thing that's changed is your position. The behavior was still despicable when you co-signed it. Yeah. Yeah, she's damning people and calling them out, calling them names and blocking them. And, like if they're for Gypsy or even have a question about Gypsy that's not dark and dangerous or dirty or rude, KJ blocks them. So it was okay for her for five years to stick up for these people and hold their lies and not hold them accountable and help hurt people through them. 
But now because she got blocked and got mad, got her fee-fees hurt, now she's on the opposite side and we're supposed to love and respect that? I don't fucking think so. It's That's my problem. The, it's hypocrisy. Right? That's my problem. It's because the Blanchers figured out what a loser she is in life. <laughs> which that. is sad I, because imagine the Blanchers think you're a loser. Yeah. <laughs> that says a lot, folks. I know. And imagine they're right about it? Rejected, imagine yeah. getting yeah. rejected by the Blanchers. Yeah. Yes, yeah, she did. Yeah. Oh, God. That is pretty bad. If you're rejected by the Blanchard, that's so yeah, the entire that's subreddit. The oh, wait, there is a subreddit on her. <laughs> there is, 15,000 people. No, there's you a get bunch rejected of stuff on her. There's, there's people that have channels, like you said, that are just out to uh, show who she is. I saw, you know, I saw pictures of her son. And um, listen, I don't think that anybody should get anybody's kid involved in anything, but she is. She keeps involved. bringing up the kid, even exactly. in Exactly, right? that's it's the a, problem. Shut up about your she's son, the one, right? She's the one that keeps bringing up her own son. And yeah, she so I mean, she's a moron, not her son. She's done it. She's done it. Yeah, you know, she's like, dude, leave him out of your stupid shit. Life. Yeah, she used to actually have fun on our on our lives occasionally. Like if she has fun her lives. Well, she used to. It's worse than I thought. Oh, like well, years. I'm going back to 2019. October. She always talks about this. Oh my son. <laughs> it's true. Stop talking about him. No one brought him up. Right there, you go, Katie. You keep bringing Listen him up. loud and clear. Why? Yeah. No, that's exactly Just correct. Shut up. And I believe. I mean, like. There is, I don't know For how sympathy. true this is, but it would explain a lot um, that she has an alcohol problem. That's, uh, yeah. You know, yeah. and, and I was in that field. I mean, I, I worked in that field legitimately. That's when I worked with the kids in the rehab. So, but, you know, and, and listen, Adderall and alcohol doesn't mix well. Uh, so, oh, I mean, that, that, and, and how about stop being live on TikTok all the time and go spend time with your son? How old is he, 40 now? These people are finally speaking my language, speaking your language, speaking all of our language, finally. I mean, Jesus Christ, how long have you been talking about this, dude? Holy Christ. Sorry, Tanya. No, no, I have heard, Tanya, I have heard a lot of creators that know her quite well, saying that she does have, she, she, she enjoys a wee tipple, let's just say. Um, well, I got two sons, how about that? Let's, let's do, you know, tit for tat. Uh, yeah. There you go. And they're not in their 40s. Like there, was video, there was a video circulating of her. She she appeared like she was drunk calling out Christy one night that somebody had posted <laughs> on TikTok. I don't have an nice account journalist. on TikTok, but somehow it was posted in one of the groups on Facebook that, I, that I'm in. And she was seemed like pretty pretty inebriated. Oh, yeah. yeah, no, I, I think I've seen her lit on a few of those <laughs> videos that people have put out. And... I mean, like that, that explains poor behavior right there because alcohol. Imagine will hit if you, she was sober you know? and this is how she is. Yeah. <laughs> that would wow. be really bad. I, again, well, you know, if she's got a platform, she can make such a difference instead of. Uh, she's in it for the money. She sees numbers yeah. with the yeah, gypsy that's the thing. thing. Yep. That's she's exactly, a piece of shit. She'll not never just change. the gypsy thing. I mean, what she did again to Garrison Brown, the Brown family, that was just despicable. That was just despicable. Like, yeah, just, it sounds like it. I don't know much about it, but it, it doesn't. I, I can see what she did. Man, and, you um, could just go see like a playlist on that. I'm telling you, this woman did probably three videos a day, fucking just calling out mm -hmm. that family, and it was like, how dare you? Like, get, how dare you? It was just I couldn't believe. I just. I think she's just jealous because. Um, she's got a bunch of insecurities. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. absolutely, that's For why she acts out this way. To have the channel she has and have those that so you got that kind of number. Of followers, if they're all real now, because they're not. Comment, you wonder, <laughs> are they all real? But so let's say they're really dumb, and, and you're worried about five or ten people that might be calling you out. You can't get past that. You don't have any thick skin yet. That's Come on. a good point. Seriously, something's wrong with you, man. Something's up with that. Yeah, it's true, right? Like, why would she get give a shit about a couple of creators telling the truth about her? Like, why does she care so much if she supposedly has all this four hundred thousand people? that follow her and then plus her Instagram and her Facebook and fucking TikTok. Why would you give a shit? Why? You want to know why? Because we tell the truth and people are listening. Here's proof that they are. I mean, she's not even that important to <laughs> bring up. She <laughs> thinks she's important in her own head. Um, but yeah. I may, I may have to have a smashing session. Please. Um, but I'm, I'm trying to evolve, guys. I'm trying to be just mellow and chill. I tried my best. I allowed her to come up here. I'll still allow her to come up here. Hell, See? She come up here. But I'd like to ask. Are you fucking kidding me? You just said you allow her to come up. I told you. He's never going to change. That is ridiculous. Why? Here's some questions now. I wouldn't talk to her. Let's see how quickly cool. she um, 
supposed to be on mute. Rage oh. quits, because one question would probably get her to rage quit. No, you'll well, suck honestly, her ass. I hope that happens, because I'm going to laugh if that happens. I My just first question is, why do you keep bringing up your son? Boom, gone. Hopefully. Yeah. Stop bringing your son up. Boom, gone. Yeah. It's, it's a sad, it's sad, really. Cause like, I don't even said. believe she has a son, to be honest with you. That's the tea. <laughs> That's what the Blanchers told me. That's how crazy she is. I mean, seriously, it's, it's, it's a joke. Oh, is it always like she's, she can never take responsibility or accountability nope. for her own actions? It's always someone else's fault. They're always the ones that have done her wrong. They're always the ones that have bullied her. She's never. Yes, Susie. I'm sorry, Apple. No, sorry, Nicole. That was Susie. You're right. She said it's part of her victim script. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. yeah. And she always has to be the one that is He's right all the victim. time. Always the victim. Never apologize. Well, you see, morbid. You see, morbid. The Blanchards told me personally that Katie Joy was like that. Ooh. Who, who heard it from that? them. I heard it from them personally. So they knew. Oh. How? <laughs> no, I'm. It's a joke. I was oh, making it's a fun joke. of them. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Oh yeah. We all we all talk to the Blanchards. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's it's joke the, poking it's fun at her. Oh, so we're not, oh, it's Pink Cloud. Hey, Pink Cloud. Hey, Pink Cloud. Hi, Pink Cloud. Now I'll call yeah. myself some. Thank you. Um, every night I say, I'm just going to listen. I'm not going to go on panel. <laughs> but then we all just start going off. And I'm like, I got to I gotta say one thing. Um, here's here's what I have to say about all this, the whole KJ thing. Um, I was actually listening to both of y'all at the same time when you started talking about this, that, the other. And I'm just like, why do you do that? Why, first of all? And the second thing I want to say is no matter uh, – and I haven't been you know, on social media for, for too long – really only consecutively um, for since like 2020. So not that long. But let me tell you, the first thing that I learned was I don't care what you say or think about me. And what you say or think about me is none of my business is the first thing I learned when I started doing my video podcast, you know, in 2020. Because when I decided to go stuff out there, stuff is going to come back to you because I can't stand the whole bad mouthing of each other. Um, man, I, because we're all just humans and none of us are perfect. That's it. Like, you know what I'm saying? I think like, you're done I get it. Katie. And, and, and one of these days, one of these days is that I hate blah, blah, blah. I get it. And no, it's not realistic because we're yeah. absolutely. If somebody starts saying pink cloud nine, this pink cloud nine, that, blah. Um, what are you doing talking about on TikTok? Go call the authorities if that is the case. Oh, wait, <laughs> yeah. because, you know, it's a stupid ass dumb troll. So we will talk about that if she wants to. And I'll put right. her in her place just as she should be in her place because That's no cool. one should d diminish or uh minimize something as serious and as that something is like that child predator to... excuse very me Hold on one, second. That's very one day there will be somebody that will say all kinds of stuff about me because they have already and if somebody were to say right now pink cloud nine this with all the horrible things that you just said that you just said that that blah 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 said i would say i would like just ignore it like ignore it Troll. <laughs> it's kind of crazy that you're even saying that because it's, it would be cool if they said his breath stinks or his shoes are dirty. Well, that would suck or, too, but... but like, yeah, no, you you're right stuff like that because that's what. Like, or I'm ugly. I got a big nose. Well, well, I okay, yeah, they're done talking about KJ. Anyway, so I thought that you guys would enjoy that and laugh with me. Um, all right, so I'm done with that. You guys let me know what you think in the comments, and I'll be back again tomorrow. Bye, guys.